Hi, I'm Matt Kaminsky and I'm the Director of Athletics and Recreation here at Columbia. And here at Columbia, our athletics program uh, proudly offers men's and women's volleyball as well as men's and women's basketball. And we're a part of the PAC West or the Pacific Western Athletic Association provincially and the CCAA or the Canadian Collegiate Athletic Association nationally. My name is Brad Thiessen. I play on the men's basketball team and I'm in the caregiving and counseling program. Well, every athlete has to deal with wins and losses. Um, in my time at CBC, at the beginning, there was a few more losses than I had hoped for. Um, coming into this year, we've started winning some games. We're almost at a 500 record, and I think coming through those losses, learning um, from them, and learning how to win as a team has just had an immense impact on how we play as a team now and how we finish games strong together as a team. These experiences as an athlete at CBC um, are only going to help me, um, whether it's with my career or with my marriage. Um, these experiences are going to give me um, something to pull off of when I, when I come across hard times or when I come across unexpected events in the rest of my life. Hi, my name is Janelle Threffel. I play women's basketball here at CBC and I'm taking general studies. Um, the one thing that's been unique about my experience here is definitely the coach. She focuses um, not just us as athletes but also as women of God. She takes the stuff that we learn on the court and she brings it off the court and develops our character and just emphasizes um, grace and caring and that we can be students and also athletes and then also women of God. So she just it's a full rounded program that she brings here. I have benefited a lot from gaining a Bearcat scholarship. One of the great things about receiving a Bearcat scholarship is that I don't have to worry about the finances. I can focus on my training, I can focus on my academics without having um, the burden of finances on me. And I'm just so thankful and so blessed to have received one because it's been really helpful. My name is Chayla Reeder and I played four years of women's volleyball at Columbia Bible College. I'm a BA grad of Intercultural Studies and I'm currently the program director at Keats Camps, which is a Christian summer camp on the Sunshine Coast. I was the very grateful recipient of an athletic scholarship in my first year, which was a huge draw for me to attend CBC, and then that continued throughout my four years. And I'm so thankful that I had a scholarship because it started me on a journey of understanding who I was as a Christian and who I was as an athlete. While at CBC, I had the pleasure and the privilege of being the team captain for three years out of my four. And one of the biggest things that I learned was that if I had a vision for my team and I wanted them to perform in a certain way, then I was the one that had to do it first. And that's a real takeaway for the rest of my life. And I think it's an example of discipleship in that as I live out my life, it can be a call to others to live in a similar fashion or to say, hey, this is how I'm figuring it out and this is my journey and I would love it if you joined me on that journey. Hi, my name is Ian Martins. Um, I was a transfer student to Columbia Bible College. I played volleyball at CBC in the men's volleyball program under Tim DeMont for three years and I was doing a Biblical Studies major and I graduated in 2004 and then I ended up coaching with Tim DeMont for probably about four years. I, after being at Columbia Bible College I went to seminary and then I went to Trinity Western and did a Master's in Leadership and right now I'm working with a Relief Development Organization based out of Chilliwack. I have a construction company in the Vancouver area and I also teach as a sessional instructor at CBC. In many ways, the team dynamic uh, at CBC is a lot like a church. I mean, people are really supported. You'll pray for one, one another. When I went through things like the loss of a loved one, um, hardship, financial hardship, life decisions, it wasn't like you would just kind of mention it to someone at like a job. 
okay, this is what I'm going through, you'd be like, hey man, I need help, I need prayer, I need you to intercede on my behalf. And so working out that in a team context, all and wrapped up in that is winning big games, losing big games, um, being there when you don't want to be there, and pushing through to be positive in those experiences. The leadership lessons I learned were totally formative for my whole life. I think that the best thing about sports is that it's a furnace for character development because in that you're faced with your weaknesses and your strengths and you're faced with wins and losses and through that you work with others and you see who you are and you're also given this foundation of strength from your coaches who because they're Christians they believe in who you are more importantly than how you perform. That's something that my coaches gave me and was 100% invaluable. And that's something that I wrestle with in ministry now because it's easy to get lost in ministry and to say I'm the program director and to lose the fact that I'm actually just Chayla and to equate my so-called successes in my workplace with who I am as a person and my value. But the reality is that I can have a success in the workplace, I can have a failure in the workplace and I'm still Chayla and I'm still loved because God loves me no matter what I do. And that's something that I began learning while I was at CBC. I just see such potential in CBC athletics. I know we have about 45 student athletes right now in the program. And if you think about all the communities, all the teams, all the different ways that they're going to serve in the next 40, 50, maybe 60 years from now, the things that they're learning here at CBC are just going to spread forth into the kingdom of God in so many different ways. And that excites me. Hi, I'm Brian Bourne, and I'm the president of Columbia Bible College. I've always been a huge fan of sports. As a kid, I played a lot, but I played just to win. What excites me particularly about Bearcat Athletics is that it's integral to the mission of this college, which is to equip people for a life of discipleship, ministry and leadership and service to the church and community. It's on the basketball court or the volleyball court that we see our students being transformed into the image of Christ. Those key values of teamwork, but especially of discipline, of perseverance in the face of trial, of being a Christian witness, even when you don't feel like it sometimes, those are the things that are instilled in our athletes. As I reflect on my time here at Columbia as an athlete, um, you know, coming out of high school, you don't really know what to expect coming to a, a college level athletic program. But as I think back, uh, two of the things that really stand out were the fact that Bearcat Athletics really strives to be excellent on the court athletically. Um, I remember as an athlete here, there was a high expectation of uh, the way you push yourself in practice and the way you're coached and the way you lift in the, in the weight room and obviously the way you compete in games and that is to be at a high level of um, pursuing excellence. And, um, because of those things, those things that were instilled in me and instilled in our teams, we actually were fortunate enough to win a national title in 2011, and that's definitely a highlight of, of my time here. The second thing I realized uh, during my time as an athlete at Columbia was, you know, while winning uh, was important and pursuing championships was important, um, coaches here and, and the program cares about how you do as a, as a person, uh, your character, your faith. Um, the coaches here really push you in your spirituality, in your faith formation, your development. Um, and they also push you in the classroom. They want to see you succeed academically and not just on the floor. Now in my role as athletic director, it is my hope and my vision that this is a place where we pursue excellence both on and off the floor. Uh, where we pursue excellence in practice, in the weight room, and in games, uh, striving for wins and championships, uh, but also in the classroom, in our faith walks and in our character and leadership development.
That is our hope for every student athlete that comes here to Columbia Bible College.